Pitstop Server 10 has some amazing new features, such as transparency flattening, a way to minimize your file size, and we're bringing color to the next level. Using ESCO artwork technology, Pitstop Server can now flatten any transparency in a PDF file. In this file, we recognize a screen blending mode on the object, as well as the fact that it is in overprint. Two issues that can now be resolved with Pitstop Server. As part of our hot folder, we now have a category called transparency flattening. We have options to set a certain resolution for any flattened object and to resolve overprints while flattening the transparency. So if we drop a file in our hot folder, we process it and we check the results. We now see that the document on the right, which is our processed file, has a normal blending mode, so no blending modes are applied to the object, and the object is now set To ensure a minimum file size coming out of Pitstop Server, we've added a few features that allow you to remove unnecessary data from your file and in that way to optimize your file size. Because we can't use global changes like in Pitstop Pro 10, we're using an action list in our hot folder. So when we process two files and we look at the initial file size of one of the files and the processed file size we see a significant difference. Next to the file size one of the features is to clip images to a certain page box in that way reducing the image data in the PDF file. Like Pitstop Pro 10, Pitstop Server 10 has additional features related to color to bring it to the next level. To perform color-related fixes in Pitstop Server, again I will use a few action lists in the hot folder. In the color management category, we've added the use of black point compensation. So if I process a file and we check the results with the pre-flight report, Clicking the hyperlink will show us the full ink coverage check, which is now also included in Pitstop Server. 